Hey folks, this is Fishy Bass NC. I'm coming at you with another unboxing. This is the February 2022 Mystery Tackle Box Elite. So here we go, the red box. All right, we're gonna open it up. And as usual, we always start with the literature and we show you what's uh, in the box with that. So first thing we'll start with is we got the Dibble Digest. This is the digest that has tips, some tricks, it has some uh, cool stories, and then, you know, every once in a while they put little games in there as well. But it's it's several pages long. It's always a good read. Um, I know a lot of people don't read these at all or just throw them aside, but I'd recommend you read it. It's fun reading. Um, it's very short and easy to read. It's going to take maybe five minutes of your time to read all of it. So um, there it is, the Dibble Digest. Take a look at it. You might actually enjoy it. Next thing in the box is the sticker of the month. So this time they sent us the goat sticker for Ketchco. That's pretty cool. I like that. That's going to go someplace special. Not quite sure where yet. Um, I may not stick it on the tackle box. I may stick it on something else. So we'll see. All right, the last piece of literature is the What's Inside the Bass Elite Box. So this is the card that tells you about the bait items that are going to be in your box and the prices. So here's this month for February 2022 in the Elite Box. And we'll get started. As usual, I usually go from top to bottom, and then I tell you the price of the item as we're looking at it as well. So we'll start at the top. Here's the Z-Man Cross-Eyes Chatterbait. This is a 3 8 of an ounce. It looks like it's in the chili dog color. I'll take this out of the package, actually. Show you a little closer up. Here's the package, okay? We're going to take it out, though, just to show you a little close-up view of this particular bait. This one comes in at $9.99. Again, it's the Z-Man cross Eyes Chatterbait. we got a bunch of stables here holding it closed. Hopefully, I can get it open without any problems. All right, let's see. We got one staple, there we go. We were dealing with one staple and we got that problem resolved. So there you go, there's the cross eyes on it. Pretty cool. Couple little orange, orange and black cross eyes. There's the little um, part on the top or on the front of the bait that's gonna, it's gonna make it actually flap through the water and makes a chattering sound as it's going through. Uh, we have a nice, long, big, thick hook here. We have a couple uh, weed, weed guards here. And we have a nice worm hook to attach any trailer baits to it. So there you go. That's in a chili, what did I say, chili dog color. I like chatterbaits. I got several of them in my tackle box and they work really well. But yeah, we'll put something on the end of that. We got a couple items in this box that might go really well with this, this uh, Z-Man chatterbait. Again, coming in at $9.99, that's the Z-Man cross eyes chatterbait. Next thing we have in a box is by Strike Pro. It's the Strike Pro Beaker. Oh, sorry, Beakster. B-E-A-K-S-T-E-R. This comes in at $9.99 too. This is a floating jerk bait. Uh, it's the Beakster 90. So there it is in the box. It's the 90 AYU for the color. It's 5 16 of an ounce. It dives four and a half to six feet and then it floats back up. So we take that out of the package, show you a little closer up picture of that. So there you go. Nice colors to it. There's the front lip on it. Hooks are sticky. So the hook's gonna make it dive down. It's gonna wobble a little bit as it dives. Then it's gonna float back up. So a nice little jerk bait there. Again, that's the Strike Pro Beakster. That one comes in at $9.99 as well. Next thing in the box is by Guggen Squad. It's the Recon. Recon is a little bit, um, it dives It dives usually up to like nine or 10 feet, I believe, maybe a little farther. 
Um, this is in a chartreuse blue and black color. It actually says it dives 8 to 12 feet. It's 2 and 3 quarters of an inch long, and it weighs 5 eighths of an ounce. So there's that bait. That comes in at $7.99. We'll take that one out of the box as well. They tape these boxes pretty well, so we'll use our we'll use our knife here to get this thing open. We'll show you a closer up view of this actual bait. All right. So there's a big old round bill on it on the front. It tells you on the bottom that it dives eight to twelve feet. Nice sticky hooks, big hooks. But there it is as a closer view. Again, that's the Guggen Squad Recon coming in at $7.99. All right, the next thing we have in the box is also a Guggen Squad product. It's the Flat Banger. That comes in at $7.99. So here it is in the box. This is this one uh, actually dives three to six feet. It's two and a half inches in length and a half ounce weight on it. We'll take that one out and show you a little closer view on that as well. So let's get inside this one here. Like I said, the Guggen Squad box or the Guggen Squad baits, they do a really cool job of uh, getting them sealed up. So when they're sitting on the shelf in the stores, they're kind of difficult to sit there and pocket one. I wouldn't advise ever doing that anyways with any baits or anything in the store for that matter. Um, but this, this definitely gives them a little, little more advantage of uh, keeping something in the, in the box and uh, hopefully not having it stolen. All right, so here's a closer look at that little square bill on the front there. Again, on the bottom, it says it dives three to six feet. There you are. These, these hooks are pretty sharp as well. Pretty sticky hooks. Flat banger. It's not rounded. If you notice here, it's flat on both sides. Some crankbaits are more rounded. This is going to give it a tighter wobble when it goes down into the water. So there you go. That one was in... The Sriracha Craw color. Again, the Guggen Squad uh, Flat Banger at $7.99. All right, next thing in the box we have is by 13 Fishing, it's the Bubble Butt. So these are uh, five, inch, uh, five inch worms. Their weight is a quarter ounce. And it looks like they have, uh, let's see, how many are in here? Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like eight of them. Um, anyways, here's the packaging. We're going to take these out. These come in at uh, $6.49 for the eight of them. You want to be able to seal it back up. We don't want to destroy the bag, so let's see if we can pop this open here. There we go. They got some definite odor to them. Uh, it's the odor is, um, or the stuff that they put on it, it's called donkey sauce. Donkey, D-O-N-K-E-Y. Um, but this is the bubble butt. Has a couple ridges, one's at the head here. You see a couple of these right here in the middle. Those are actually really good if you wanna um, put a wacky rig, uh, ring on the middle there and have this hook up as a wacky rig and then of course there's the uh, end of it the bubble butt as they put it but yeah that looks like it'd be pretty cool to uh, put on the throw I haven't thrown one of these in a while but this potentially could go with with that um, the Z-Man chatterbait that we got earlier anyways this has a uh, let's see I don't know if it tells a color on here or not. It does not tell a color. Oh, sorry. Yes, it does. It's the number 11 collared greens color. 
So there you go. That's a nice little worm there. I'll try that out. Again, that's at $6.49 by 13 Fishing. It's the bubble butt and it's an eight pack. There you go. All right, next thing we have is by Weston. It's the Weston Shad Tees Slim. So this is a four pack of um, Shad Tees uh, um, paddle tails and it's in a sparkling green. They are three inches long. There's the box that comes in. I'll take one of these out and show you a little closer view. So there you go. Little eye on the front there, paddle tail on the end. Very nice bait. That tail is going to give you a lot of water action. That could also be a, a decent trailer. Or you could fish this probably, um, you could fish it as a drop shot or a Texas rig is, if you wanted to go ahead and do that. So the Weston Shad Tea Slims, they're $5.99 for the four of them. They come in that little package there, which I'm going to attempt to put everything back in here and hold it still while it's not flopping around anyplace else. Okay, we're going to put that, close that. There you go. Nice little bait. Can't wait to try those. All right, the next thing we have is by Guggen Squad. It's the Juicy Jig. So here you go. Here's another jig. It's not a chatterbait style jig. It's just a regular... Uh, Looks like a football head on it, maybe? It's definitely definitely a uh, stand-up type uh, face on it. Again, Guggen products are tough to get out of the out of the case. But once you do, and you take a look at them, they're really nice. So this is, I believe, in the, in the uh, green pumpkin color here. So your standard green pumpkin colors. There's the base I was talking about where it's gonna, it's gonna sit in the water and it's gonna stand up like that in the water. There's a little weed guard that goes up and down there, protect you from uh, getting snagged on the weeds. It, all it also has a bait hook right here, where if you're tying on a, a trailer of some type, that hook right there is going to hold it and help keep it on here so it doesn't pull off the, off the hook. There you go. The Guggen Squad Juicy Jig, 3 eighths of an ounce in the green pumpkin. And that comes in at $4.99. All right, the next thing we have in the box is by Lake Fork. It's the Lake Fork Trophy Lures Baby Shad, coming in at $3.49. Uh, these are two and a quarter inches long. They're in the black chartreuse and silver flake so here's the bag that they come in again these are two and a quarter inch long so they're, they're kind of a tiny bait which is fine again makes a really nice trailer to tie this onto that Guggen Guggen squad but there you go I don't know if you can see it but there's little eyes right here in the front Let's see if we can see that or not and we have a couple little ridges that will make this thing, if you don't hook it past this first part of the head, that'll let this stuff kind of move a lot in the water. There's a little tail on the end there with a little ball and it's gonna, it's gonna make a lot of splash of water. So these are pretty cool. Um, there looks like there's about 10 of them maybe. There's the package. And that comes in at $3.49. That's a pretty good value for, for that many bait. Looking forward to trying that. I don't think I've ever tried something like that before, but that should be interesting. All right, the last thing we have in the box is by Spearpoint Performance Hooks. And this is their three-aught size. It's a three-pack. These are the hooks I've told you about before, where the uh, bottom of it, when you hook a fish, it stays, it stays hooked. That's their claim to fame. So I've tried some of these hooks before and they work really, really well. Um, 
Anyways, that's all that's in this month's box. Uh, this is February 2022 Mystery Tackle Box. Um, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Uh, you know, help me out by building this channel. Turn on that notification bell. That way you notice when I put out new videos such as this one. And um, you're notified about that. And we also have some uh, live drawings every once in a while. If you weren't here or you're new to the channel um, in the last week or so, I um, missed out on a couple really cool packages that I sent out this week to a couple anglers. So hope they're enjoying it. Um, go ahead and comment on this box. You know, tell me what baits you liked, what baits you didn't like. Um, you know, I, I'll definitely, you know, answer comments. So tell me, tell me what you like. Tell me what you don't like. Um, let me know if you actually uh, would try any of these particular baits. And, uh, or it's a bait that you may have already tried once before and it works out great for you. Um, or it works out bad. It could work out bad. But let me know. Put it down in the comments down there. Also, down below this video, there's a description area. I'm going to have some other social media sites on there that I belong to. And I sure would appreciate if you'd follow me or like me out there at the social media sites. Um, the last thing I'm going to put in there is a uh, link to how you can get your own mystery tackle box. You can get $10 off on your first box. And uh, that link will certainly help me out um, to keep doing the unboxings and showing you some new products and as, as well as giving away products. Um, we're going to try to do a lot of giveaways this year. We're also going to get out there and fish. I know there's been a couple of responses that says I don't fish. I actually do fish. Um, you can see a couple of videos in the past that I've fished. I don't fish a lot, unfortunately, but I do fish. And uh, I'll have some videos coming up with that real soon. The last couple of weeks here in North Carolina, the weekend, it snowed each weekend for the last three weeks. So fishing was a little, eh, it wasn't so great. I decided not to fish the last three weeks. I'm going to hopefully get out this weekend coming up and uh, get you guys a video for fishing real soon. Um, I'm planning on using this debates and stuff that I got today in this box. So stay tuned. Again, hit that subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, check out my other uh, social media sites, make a comment on this uh, video, all that good stuff. Uh, hit the like button, a thumbs up. That's the last thing I forgot to tell you. Don't, don't forget to hit the like. That helps get this video where it is uh, to be seen on YouTube and people can find it easier and um, hopefully they'll enjoy the, the content. So anyways, this has been Fishing Bass NC. Have a great day. Fish on.